What is going on? I'm back at y'all. We going live at Perfume Unlimited in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Yes, indeed. Let me uh, get my water out the car. You know I like to have my bottle of water. What's going on with y'all? What y'all doing? Y'all still chilling? Still chilling? I'm gonna grab my water here. All right, think of hitting that like button coming in the door. Think of hitting the like button. Let's put Walmart out here. I need to find a Walmart. You know what I'm saying? Here we are going here. So this perfume, unlimited. And uh, I'm gonna show you all around when I get in here. I've only been here one time before, and this is where I picked up my Alexander J. All right? And he has a lot of fragrances here, like I said, that Nier doesn't have in his situation. Okay, I never had, I never had Kimmy uh, Hyatt. Yo guys, I might be losing signal in here. It looks like I don't get a lot of signal inside the store. So look like we may have to not, I wanna take y'all through as quick as I can before I lose signal. You might have to end this. But y'all got to see Raj, I'm not sure why, up to 70% off. So hopefully I can get a good deal. You know, that's probably mainly on designers, but we'll see, all right, so. We'll get in here and I'll give y'all more information later on if I have to. But right now they're doing inventory. So since they're doing inventory, you know, I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna try to take y'all around real quick before the signal go bad again. All right, he has a lot of designers, as you can see. They kind of mixed up. He had Letar Sin. He has some, uh, some Letar's perfume moves. Oh, let me turn around, I'm sorry. He has Creed. Large Sin Parfumer. He has another, he has another fragrance in here. And when I left, somebody told me, man, you should have got that. And I'm gonna see if I can find it when I'm here. And he also has the florist. So you guys who like florists, honey oud, leather oud, he has all the florists. He had them with the regular top, then he had them in the box. So he has both, okay? All right, let me speed around. Speed around, we get to the niche. He has just about all the Atkinsons. So you guys in the Atkinsons, he has Atkinsons. He has Odin, which is kind of rare for somebody to have Odins. He has Mark Buxton. Oh man, I really like that Mark Buxton, the ghost one. That ghost one was really good. He has uh, some M. McAleff, as you can see. All right, and then we upstairs, we have some Frappin. We have some Parfums de Marley. All right, we're going across. He has some TT, Taziana Terenzi. He also has some Terry Gunsberg, which is crazy. Bois, he has some time for it, it's okay. And of course, as we said, some Anique Cattile. Up top, he has a couple of uh, Maison Francis Kirk John pieces. He has some Bonds, down there Anique Cattile. And there's my baby over there, who uh, I got people going crazy over, Iris Violet. Even though, no, that's not Iris Violet, that is actually the nearest Sierra I got I gotta, I gotta, I gotta smell the red one. A friend of mine just got that. Yeah, he said that's good. So, Jerry, I'm going to check out the one you are wearing today. And the red one is supposed to have, um, he said cedar and plum is in that one. No testers? We're going to open this up for you. You sure? You don't have to. You really We're don't. Gonna open it up for you. Okay, Roger's going to open it up. Here's the one you have, Jerry, that you wore for your center today. And that is, uh, what's the name of it? That's the golden oud. Oh, this is different. That's golden oud. Okay, this is a red bottle called golden oud. He's wearing something called, um, oh gosh, I forgot. But he's wearing, he has a red, oh, this is a gold bottle. Uh-oh. Golden oud. Look at this bottle. Y'all know the bottles are beautiful. Let me just smell off the nozzle there. See if we can get some. I really can't smell it. Let's, let's do it. Can you do it? You sure? Let's okay. do it. I'm gonna spray this on a little part of my hand, just a little spritz. That's all I need right there. Hey Jerry, which one you wearing? Oh my sore. My sore? I have that. Oh, he has that. He has my sore. Okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah, he does have my sore. Can we see that one? Because he's talking about that one. This is pretty good. Wow, this is Udi. Yeah, but it's golden it's soft. Oud. Yeah, I know it's soft, but it may project later though. 
Yeah. It is softer, yeah. It's not the oody oud. Yeah. It's not the crazy, crazy oud. All right, so there's golden oud. Yeah, right, exactly, exactly. It's not for the, as we say, the Eastern palate. Okay. Yeah, he does have the, uh, the Mysore. So let's see what you're talking about, Jerry, since you're on board here. Jerry, I forgot to ask you, did you get full presentation on that? Uh, on that? All right. My man was talking about it all morning. There it is. Box. Oh, oh, got it. Oh, it's pinkish. Okay. Can we take that out? All right. Just those little squitsy squitsy. Right, hold on. See, see what you talk about here, Jerry. See if it's what you said it is. He's, he said, he said plum and cedar wood, and it's awesome. So we're gonna let it dry down. All right, big guy. We're gonna see. Yeah, it is plummy too. This is sweet. A nice oil. What's the dry down, Jerry, on this? What's the dry down? This smells good. It is sweet, too. Is the cedar going to start kicking in on this a lot? Let me take my jacket off, by the way. Now we got a plum cedar. Yeah. Well, tell me, how does it dry down? Does it dry down to the cedar or does it dry down to the plum? Which one does it dry down to? Or it drives down, is it linear? It just drives down. Yeah, you can smell the plum. Or it drives down to the cedar, okay. All right. It's definitely nice and sweet on that one. What's going on, TM? What's the uh, what's your number on that one, Raj? Uh, okay, take your time. Yes. Yeah, he has a house I saw. Like I said, when I left, I'm like, oh, it's probably oh the Miller Harris. That's what it is. This Miller Harris is supposed to be some good juice. Let me turn around. I'm sorry, y'all looking at me. This Miller Harris is supposed to be really, really good. I think it's really expensive too. Fuels de tabac. Yeah, I don't think y'all. One ten. Tax, non tax. Plus tax. Plus tax. Okay, okay. Three point four. Three point four, right? Okay, that's about what my man paid. He paid a hundred plus tax, so ten dollars more. Okay, we'll keep that on. La Fume Intense. I'm curious about these Miller Harris's. Y'all know I like stuff nobody has. I don't like buying what everybody has. Mullinard, Umbrella. Okay, okay. All right, let's get over here to what I really, what you really turned me on to. Now, how'd you end up getting the, uh, how'd you end up getting this line? I'm sorry. How'd you end up getting this line? You just asked and he sent it to you? I have, you know, I mean, we have some sources. Okay, okay. Good, good, good. Because that's rare. You only can find this in Barney's. You can't find this no place else. I was in New York, and that's where I saw it, in Barney's. Yep. Uh, yeah. well, we, have, we have a lot of connections. Okay, okay. He has a lot of collections, uh, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry. We're all legit. Oh, yeah, we know that. We're not worried about not being legit. He said it all legit, like I, like I doubted him. Especially since I've been Safar. Safar Au, I think that was what that was called, right? With the uh, Alexander J, yeah. Got to find a spot. I'm all sprayed up for the day. All right, now what's the best you can do on the bow makers? What size are you either size. Size. Well, give me both prices on either side. Cause, uh, okay. Yeah, let me know. He's about to tell me now. Well, you know I like bow makers. I told you all when I was at Barney's, I like bow makers. And it lasts forever and ever. And these are the new tops. So this is not the old, this is not the old ones. These are the new ones. I heard cowboy grass is pretty good too. Somebody mentioned cowboy grass. Radio Bombay. 
Hold on, gang. Let me uh, put y'all on. Let me sit the camera down so I can get busy here. Cowboy grass. Okay. Well, grass pretty decent. It is not bow makers. It is not bow makers, not by far. And I let, I got a sample of bow makers because uh, Tyler Tyler gave me a sample of bow makers when I was in uh, what's called. And I let her smell it last night. Y'all remember if y'all looked at the video, I let her smell it. She's like, I like this. She said she liked it. So he gave me a good price. That's it for me. I'm good. Mm-hmm. Or 124 in 84 or 124? Yeah, that's 230 for this one. That's there. This one. 84 or 124. Why is the juice so much different? Maybe because it's a different bottle. Hold on here. Whew. We have Paris too. You have Paris to L.A. Or what we do in Secret in Paris? Okay. Yeah. I have, I have the new one. It's called Dirty Sexy. Just got out of bed. Messy Sexy. Just got out of bed. Yeah, yeah I had that. That's pretty good. Real sweet. Really, really sweet. That bow maker's good. It's gonna be one of them. Yeah, no problem. I gotta see. I can, I can pick it up off of there. It's, just, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. I might want to pick up something else. So, if I don't pick up anything else, I'm just gonna grab this one. Pick up something else. I got to spit the cost to be no the boss. Problem. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, man, crazy. All right. He's busy. I don't want to do too much, but y'all know how I am. I got to look around some more. You know, one thing he had here last time, he had, uh, he had, you had Ohm. You had, uh, you had Gucci Ohm. The little Gucci Ohm bottle. It was over there when we left. Yeah, yeah, the old Gucci. Yeah, yeah. I was wondering if you still had that. Yeah, you might have sold that. Yeah, because I bought a five mil, a little small five mil one. No, don't worry. Don't sweat it. Oh, there it is right there. Right there. I just want, I want them to see this bottle. Yeah, it's the Gucci Pro. It's just the woman's. Yeah, it's the woman's. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's totally different. Really? Well, oh, oh, yeah, because it will say Pro. Yeah. Oh, man. And, uh, but can't get either one. It's mm -hmm. Long gone. Right, right. Yeah, they are. Like I said, I have a five mil of the Pro. Right. Got with some of my Texas. So I bought two of them. Little small ones. Yeah, the bottle's still sexy, too. Thank you, sir. I just want everybody to see that just in case you were interested. So I can give them all your information. Now, here, here's the florists. Now, I know Jerry has a couple of the florists. Uh, the honey oud. What's the price on the honey oud with the top? Uh, actually, we got a good deal on the honey oud. Uh, I've got them. Uh, i got some tester boxes in. Right, right. No caps. It's like uh, only like 100 and Really? No cap? Out of the box. Yeah, well, you know, they just got that right, just, plastic. Right, right, exactly. Well, how, how does the cap look anyway? Is it all that impressive? Well, it's a nice cap. You know, if, if you have to have it, if, if this is how it is for me. If it's personal use, I need it. Right. So, is it about the juice? It's, it's all about the juice. Right, right. If it's a gift, then. Right, you, know, you want it has the box. Got gotcha. you, exactly. Yeah, things like it's going to run about 100. And, Okay, 138 for the full presentation, and 10, 108, 108, 109. 109. Okay, for what's So you got, but still, both the prices are really good, really good. Okay, so you guys who like florists, there you go. You can't beat that price. 138 and 109 without the top, without the presentation. Okay, we're gonna move around a little bit more. All right, big guy. Go ahead, do your thing. I got you now. I wanted to make sure I got the two new things. I want to smell. I want to smell that. I want to smell that. All 
All right, so we're looking around a little bit more. Okay, they have a citrus molecule too. I see it back there. They have a citrus molecule. So basically, he has a lot of designers. He has a lot of designers, just as well as the niche too. A designer and niche. Let's see, it's Creed Nemo. I'm trying to see something gonna catch my eye that I haven't seen in a while. I'm like, hey, hey, what about that one? Yeah, you know, because sometimes a good, a good old time designer is worth getting. You know what I mean? It all depends on uh, what you're looking for. Can y'all hear me? I had the mic all in here. Yeah, an old time designer is always worth picking up. Like Avogadro's would be pretty good. But I'm not spending my money on that. Spend my money on bow makers. Oh, ideal. You know, I always want to smell ideal by Guerlain. This would be pretty cool. When I mean, he gets a chance, I can get a chance to sniff on that if you got a man around. But they're doing inventory right now, so. And he has some Montals. Y'all know we got the Honey Oot Montal. Y'all know how I feel about that. Oh, these are new Juliet has a gun. He has those too, okay. Intense Cafe, Dark Oud. You know, I wish he had, I wish he had some Mancera's. He could have been. I know a lot of you guys are Mancera heads. And his prices are really, really good, so. Probably been a good chance to get a Mancera. I thought it was McCollis the first one I saw him. Hey, stand by y'all. Stand by a second. I got to do this again. Got cufflinks on, so I can't do it so much. Yeah, have some gift sets for you guys. You want to do some gift sets. I know most of y'all niche heads. Y'all not looking at any niche, so. I mean, designer, but still want to show you what he had. Just in case you know. And of course, he ships. So, if you guys see anything you want, let's give him a buzz and he ships it. Okay. Oh, he has the uh, Lancome. Oh, okay. I wonder if that's the Lettre, Lettre Oud, or the, uh, what you call them, Oud. Okay, and he also has Antillier, by the way. When I get home, I think I have, um, I have Cafe Tuparosa waiting for me. What's going on? What's going on, Jamie Starr? How you feel? Did you get your nose on some good? <laughs> now, I don't want to spell Gucci Envy. I'm all right. I'm cool with that. I don't want to spell Tory, but I'm telling you, I think this uh, Miller Harris. Anybody ever heard of Miller Harris? Y'all ever heard of that? He has some custom national bottles, too. Uh, which Mason Francis Kerr John? Which one? Any one in particular? So I can ask one in particular. Which uh, Maison? Because I'm looking up top and he has, uh, he has the Oud Velvet. 
X straight, which I have that. Uh, here the Oud Sook Mu, like X straight. Here the Oud Cashmere. Like he has Pluriel up there, and maybe uh, the other one. So he has a couple up there. Okay. What's that there, young man? Santal Wood. That sounds familiar. Montal. Oh, it's Montal. Okay, okay. Amelia Absolute Atelier. Oh, really? Gold Leather. That's Atelier. Yeah, yeah. Who's Vanilla Absolute? Who's this by? Atelier. This Atelier? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, Cedric Bois. Y'all know y'all love some Cedric Bois. So what we're doing now is we're getting them decanted. Nice. Okay, okay let them know. Right. So they're being decanted. Our customers have already cleaned us out when most of them came in. And uh, so they're like eight mils. So we're going to get about, I think about 80, 90 sprays. Wow. From one of these. And the price point is so attractive that as opposed to spending big money, they right. start getting their collection going. Right. And if they really, really enjoy something, can't live without it, they say, hey, time for me to get my full-size bottle. Okay. So it's kind of similar to what they're doing online with the, uh, I, I forgot the name of it. The, they do it, um, yeah, I, sit, I, whatever they are, yeah, the 14 exactly. mils. Exactly. Okay, but you're doing your own. We, we do our own. And... Um, we have a customer base that's been requesting, requesting like, we love guys asking for frapping. Right, right, right. So mm -hmm. we've got uh, like speakeasy. Oh, really? Okay. And we've got, uh, I think, Passion. Yeah, Passion Bois, I have that one. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. I have Passion Bois. And, uh, yes, he does ship. He ships. Yeah, they ask where you're shipping. I don't know. Yeah, you ship. Why do we ship? Mm hmm mm hmm so what are these costing? Depending on the depending on which one it is, uh, okay. they're gonna run. Uh, like, uh, are they mostly niche or are they mostly design or are they both? Mostly niche. Mostly niche. Good, good. Niche. Yeah, yeah. Uh, some of our customers have asked us if we would do it with some of the better designer brands, but they're mm -hmm. not expensive enough for. Right. But we might. Right, right. You know, we, we might. It's it's what the customer wants. Okay. You know. So just give us a rough idea. Just a rough, uh, you can look it up. So far, what we've seen, they're going between 18 and 25 bucks. That's, okay. That's been the price point. That's not bad. Yeah. Okay, 18 for 8 mil. Yeah. 8 mil, okay, got you. So 8 mil, anywhere from 18 to $25. Design, I mean, niche sense, mostly niche, like, definitely niche. Like we expect to start the creed in soon. Mm -hmm. and some of the creeds will most likely be a little more expensive, especially right. the uh, Aventus. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, say for instance you don't have it here, can you order it? Most likely. Most likely, okay, I got you. And they, so you don't do the decanting, someone else does the decanting. Okay, got you, got you. That sounds like a good option, gentlemen. You know, we busy buying decants online, you know, on Facebook, we can get them from, get them from Raj. I mean, we probably have more of what we want instead of having to wait for somebody to bring something we want. Here, he can get it for us automatically. So that's a good move. Great move. Yes, sir. Take care of that customer. Definitely. Well, I know what I'm getting ready to get, you guys, but I still got to look around. Tell me about the Miller Harris, if you can, please. Because I heard a, a little bit when I left you that day, yeah. somehow Miller Harris just popped up somewhere. I'm like, they make some good smoky stuff. Yeah, I like they smoky. Know. A lot of the Miller's ha Miller Harris product is, is really smoky. I mean, that's, I think, his signature. Right, right, right. Okay, it's, okay. It's that smokiness to it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And uh, more, more Europeans know Mil Miller Harris than the Americans. Right, right. Mm-hmm, uh, mm -hmm. It's not a name that's well recognized here. Right, right. Uh, except for the niche customer base. Right. Uh, like I said, I just ran into it one day, and I heard someone talking about it. I said, hey, I need to get my nose on that. So tell me, did you know about them, which one's the most smokiest one over here? Well, or do they have like a tobacco uh, or a leather? I think that all the, the 
Kuma's are. Okay. okay. And, uh, I like Maroc a lot, but this would be. Okay. Well, she has some pieces of paper. Can you don't mind? Let me get spray it on. Oh, there you go, right there. I forgot you had those. Duh. All right, so we're going to check out this mirror high iris. Which one is this one? That bottle is lovely, too. Look at that bottle. Unless it dries down, it's not the way I remembered it okay. a couple of years ago. And which one is that? This is the uh, Moroc. Okay. It smells ambery. It, it does. And, uh, what about the tobacco right next to it? I'm going to assume that that's tobacco. Hmm. No? This, oh, yeah. yeah. I don't even have to go far for this one. Okay, okay. Let's spray that one there. Right to me. Now, are these, I noticed the bottles, the boxes are playing boxes. So are these testers or are they? Yes. Okay, cool. Whenever they're available. Right. Okay, if I get a call that says I have testers, mm -hmm. my response is ship it. Okay, got you. Got you. I don't smell a lot of tobacco in there, but I smell some. Almost like a cigar tobacco. Exactly. Right. But especially with the Miller Harris, because they come with the caps. Right, which is a beautiful thing, right. Uh, and anything else? Yep. A Robbie? I like that might be pretty cool. Okay. Let's spray it up. I should have put my pen in to write these down. Right, what we have here. Okay, which one is this? Classic. Oh yeah, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. And what about that uh yeah, that one there? I know I'm not gonna like tuberosa. Yeah, I got you right here. Yeah, Ravi. Yeah, can you know remind me of uh, Serge Tans has a, a Ravi? Yeah. Doesn't smell like it, but it does. Oh, you familiar with a Ravi? <laughs> I just want to get my nose on it. Somebody was talking about that last night. Yeah, no, it's not. From just knowing the nose of a Ravi, right. that's not it. Yeah. Okay. With, with all the Miller Harris's, I noticed that the uh, smokiness comes at the dry down. So okay. It really. Uh, Starts kicking in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is really ambery. So that one, the first one you did, is the, really ambery. The, the, first the one Moroc. Is the Moroc. Yeah. yeah. How's that intense? What's going on with the intense? Uh, I think you have the intense there. I think. No, I don't think you did intense because we went right to Tabak next. Okay, and that's the full presentation box right there. It's nice. I like that. Nice box. A slide box. Okay, and this is pretty good. They kind of had the same DNA. Yes. Yeah, you got the same DNA. Okay, cool. Yeah, that box is nice. Look at that. That's nice. Okay, and it slides out. Very nice. And who's that, Vegger? Vegger. Vegger, okay, okay. Trying to grab two. Now, what are the prices? Of the, where do they range from? The testers. Okay, we can get a chance. Oh, this is oh, this is pretty good. It's kind of greeny. All right. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. This this Vester is or better better burger. This burger is pretty good. Right. Yeah, what's called definitely Ambery. How are you doing? All right. Good, how are you? Great. I see you didn't come alone today. Yeah, today I came with my. You came alone. Yes. Yeah. How are you? I'm good. Yeah. What's the, the uh, Moroc? I like the Moroc more. You like the Moroc? I like the Moroc, yeah. Mm. Yeah, I like I like ambery scents. Mm. Real strong amber scents. Don't think it's really strong. I'm gonna look up the notes when I get a chance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, 
you know, self-serve. Mm-hmm. Okay, thank you. Right. Water, vodka, <laughs> right. Well, I'm here till you close. You know how I do. I stay till you close the place. So, I'm, I'm already, I'm here to go. Yeah, this, this Tabak. I mean, after Tabak, this, this called uh, Maroc. Yeah, I'm gonna be right back. Yeah, I'm gonna check these notes out real quick. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm back. Usuk Mood, I know. Usuk Mood is 375. Yo, check out the outlets. I am an out. No, they don't have. They don't, bro, the outlets don't have niche over here. The outlets have, what you call him? He's the only one doing niche over here. What's going on, Christian M? Yeah, man, yeah. I'm not sure if he has a website. He may. I'll ask him. Uh, I got to ask him. Oh man, I'm a man, yo. Oh man. Man, I don't know what I want, man. That Miller Harris is nice. But I like the bow makers too. Y'all know I like bow makers. Yeah. You got a lovely price on the bow makers too. The price is just like you yo, you just yo. But the small bull makers, I'm trying to get like, get the small bull rating, the Miller Harris. I got to stay under 200, y'all. I can't go over 200 again. I spent like 130 yesterday. So I got to try to get around this, see if I can pop this off. Because I don't know if I need a full 100 Miller bull makers. This smells so much different. 84. I'm definitely getting 100 mil of the bow makers. I gotta have it. I, I gotta have 100 mil. Cause see, the, the thing, I'm not, it's kind of funny because the juice is a different color than the, um, the juice is a different color than the 50. So this is the 50, I'm not sure whether it's because of the 50, but this is the 50 mil juice. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with it, I'm just saying it's just 50 mil juice. And then the 100 mil is like this. But it seems as though I'm smelling it back and forth. It seems as though the, the 100 mil smells different a little bit. Than the um, than the fifty mil. It just it smells different. So I'm thinking one may be an old formulation, one may be a new formulation. Yeah, but I, I like bow makers. I'll ask in a second. Nah, I doubt that. Nah, that that's that's definitely not the same. I mean, how really this right here? That would be impossible, bro. So, nah, I'm not I'm not going with that. Oh, let's see.
Yeah, that's all I was thinking too. Yeah, yeah, I think they do different concentrations if you ask me, because they smell like this is a perfume, 50 mil, but they both say perfume though. They both say perfume, but like I said, the colors is different. But I think that's because I think maybe, um, again, when you, with the smaller ones, it's probably a lighter color than the bigger ones, probably a darker color because of the bottle. But of course, y'all know I know what it smells like, so. Definitely. Yeah, I know, right? Exactly, exactly. See, I can, I can smell, I can smell it now. I think because of the density of the juice being 100 mil as opposed to being a 50 mil, I think it's the density uh, more than anything else. I'm going with the density of that. And like I said, it's only a $30 difference. So I think he said one, I think he said 120. I don't know. I don't know if it was a $40 difference or a, a a thirty dollar difference, you know, in between the two. Yeah, so I'm not sure. I mean, they definitely different in price, but you know, sometimes you just pay the thirty dollars and you gotta make it up someplace else. But I think I'm gonna try to see if I can get two from them, see if I can get a good price on two. Um, if I buy the, uh, I want to get the other one on my arm too. I gotta get that on my arm to see what's up. I got these cufflinks on, man. I can't get anything done. I gotta take the cufflinks off. Hold on. Now, I'm going to do this again one more time with some fresh skin, just to make sure. Like I said, I don't mind the maceration process. I don't have no problem with that, but I just want to make sure that uh, I'm going to be here for about an hour anyway, so I get a chance to make, to make sure everything is cool. Okay. I want to get a uh, witch comb on my nose when I get a chance. I'm sorry? I want to get... Uh, the Miller Harris, if I can get that on my skin. No problem. Uh, this, Durga, uh -huh. this is their most expensive item. Really? Mm -hmm. This is like their signature. They, they only gave us the one piece. Really? So that's it. Okay, okay. Yeah. Have you is, smelled that one yet? Yeah, this is their okay. signature. It's called Durga. I didn't know it even had a signature. Yeah. Okay. That's well, we won't spray that one. That's what they're really doing. Right, right. Mm. All right. Could I get a, uh, can I get a spray of the uh, Maroc? The Maroc. Yeah, I get it. Thank you, sir. I was about to answer you. My name too. So, huh? Okay. Yep, he does have Creed. Really, why are you going on? Why are you going on like that, Jamie? Stop playing, man. It ain't that kind of. Ain't that kind of play. I bought from him before. This is not my first time here. I purchased uh, I purchased a couple things from him before, so he legit, man. He liked them guys downtown and you know places like that. He just got to connect, like he said. You know. And why would he have something like this? That don't make any sense. You know. So, teach his own, bro. I'm cool.
Oh, come on, man. Make up. Come on, man. Stay, stay focused, man. Stay focused. I'm trying to focus on one thing. <laughs> you don't have me all over the place. I'm trying to stay focused. <laughs> I see that Gucci. How you know had a Gucci belt on, man? I had Gucci sunglasses, too, but I left them in the car. You know what I thought you was talking about? No guitars. No guitars. Oh, he has Nasamato. Oh. She just pulled that out. Nasamato, ladies and gentlemen. Nasamato. It's got to be pardon, my favorite right here. Oh, wow. It's the last one? Oh, pardon is that juice. That's the juice right there. I have like five of these. I know. It got to be. Well, absinthe, okay. Um, they want to know the price. Um, for, they're all different. Oh, they're all different? Okay, okay. And they have black Afghano, of course. Right, that's the retail. They don't do retail up here. There's no retail. Right, right. 159. Yeah, usually around the same price, all of them 185. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to show you do yours. Y'all got it? 150 for the, for the, um, for the part in 159. Yeah, it's supposed to be the same, yeah. That's pardon right here in the box. I know, not bad at all. That's, that's 30 something dollars off. Are you kidding? Absolutely. But she has this four. She brought them out, so we can check them out. So let me know. I'll let them know. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> all right. So you're looking good there. This. Which one is that one? Dark. Musk, silver musk. Mm. Is it? Mm. Oh, narcotic, yeah, narcotic, big, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty cool too. This is for, the, but this is like the best. Right. Well, you know, we we perfume collectors, so we wear anything. If it smells good, we wear it. Ain't that right, gentlemen? We don't care whether it's women or men. It smells good, we wearing it. Yes, yeah, that's how we do. I'm trying to get used to Maroc. This Maroc smells pretty good, y'all. I can smell the plum. I can definitely smell the plum. I just want to see how long it lasts. See what kind of longevity we have. I want to get the bow makers. I think we get the bow makers in the Moroc. I wish they had the Moroc in the 50 mil and the bow makers I can get in the 100, you know? But, um, no, but then I can just get the bow makers, man, and when I can afford the Moroc, I'll get it. No jig off. No jig off. We have Montal. He has a Julia Has a Gun super collection. Montals. Okay. And like I said, he has a florist. Okay. So, so he, so he has a niche. Let me tell y'all another good one, man. Y'all may, y'all may not think this is a good one, but this one is a good one. It's made for women, but it's actually, you can wear this. You know what it is? Check it out. That one. That one right there is good. That's some good juice right there, man. I couldn't believe it when I smelled it, man. You know, it's almost like Coach 3. I wish he had them old coaches. But it's almost like Coach 3. You know, you can't find Coach 3 anymore. But uh, Coach made some good juice. They made some really good juice. But that one right there in that bottle, that is good. It has oud in it. I think it has oud. Um, it has some woods in it. You would think it's like a man scent. But it's, they got it up for women. So you may want to check that out. You may want to check that out. I hear you. I hear you, man. But look at it. Like I said, I, um, 
I, I'm cool. I'm comfortable. Believe me. If I wasn't, I wouldn't be here. I'm, I'm very comfortable. Yeah, I'm comfy, comfy. And like I said, it wasn't like, I bought something from here before. I bought, this is why I got my first Alexander J. I got my, uh, I got my Zephyr Aoud from here. So, um, yeah, plus they take inventory, man. They don't mess around. It's not, it's not the kind of party. But I can understand you being skeptical. Only when you come in here, you might look and say, this is just like one of them shops, like personal mania or something like that. But when you start looking at what he really has, you know what I mean? Like you say, you see the creeds, and they don't have cellophane on them, right? Do you see any cellophane on them creeds? No. No cellophane. And also, just looking around, and just looking at some of the scents, I mean, do you, do you have to really know what you're talking about to get these scents, like Etro. Etro. Yes, yeah, I'm saying, yeah. If, that, if, that, if I saw that, then I'll, I would have been like, oh, you know what? Mm -mm, mm -mm. But they don't have cellophane on them because they're not, they're the real deal. But check out the Etros. Somebody was talking about one of these Etros is really, really good. I'm not sure which one it was. But, uh, yeah, again, man. Would you say why, though? You don't know anything about that? About the cellophane? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you ever buy one that has cellophane on it, it's fake. Because Creed don't put cellophane on their <laughs> Creed don't put cellophane on their boxes. As you can see. They don't do that. He even have a Creed, he even has a Creed flacon up there. I'm not sure what that flacon is, but it's a Creed flacon. Oh yeah, a couple of Creed flacons. Okay, he has another one here. Another Creed back on. So if y'all have any questions, I'm gonna give y'all, I'm gonna give y'all his number. His name is Raj, just like me. Y'all can call and ask any kind of question you want. You wanna know if you have a website, Raj? I'm sorry. You have a website? No. Alright, he doesn't have a website. But he'll give me his number and I'll um I'll definitely uh, give y'all his number. There's DS Durga up here. What is this? What are we looking for? What's that DS Durga? Uh, that's the, uh, that's the, uh, you know, that's the, uh, called the Basia. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I've heard of that. Yep, yeah, that's the Basia, and that's the only Oh, the Debaser. Okay, gotcha. Debaser, yeah, yeah, okay, I call it Debaser. All right, all right. What we have in there? That's right. Ripe fig, coconut milk, taco, blonde woods. Oh, you need to have this out. It's the only one you have, huh? Wow, I'm gonna have to look it up. I'm gonna have to look that up. Wow. Our rep always called the base, the Bassier. Yeah, the Bassier. Okay, okay, I got you. Yeah, it looks good. Bassier, y'all used to see that. You find all our goodies. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, no doubt. That's why I like to look around when I come in here. And like I said, oh, that's the Etro. Yeah, I heard about it. This will be one Etro is really, really good. Is that the one? This is the. Well, we we do a lot of Etros. Etro here. Okay, and Etro. Okay, okay. Etro, Etro. But this uh, Rajasthan is always uh, appreciated. Okay. Rajasthan. It smells a little sweet, am I right? Saffron in it. Saffron? And, uh, Look at this bottle. Wow. Look at that. Yeah. Definitely looks good. The bottle itself makes you want to buy it because the bottle is so beautiful. Absolutely. Just like the uh, uh, Velisari. Uh, Mm. Lorenzo Velisari, that's another. Right, which is the top, that's all those, yeah. You know, really do well with the. And uh, their fragrance called Kama Subra. Mm -hmm. And Kama Subra uh, is, uh, 
statement, I smelt Kama Sutra. Uh -huh. I'm not saying this. <laughs> He's not saying it. <laughs> yeah. It is, it's been considered to be reminiscent of a French whore house. It's really? Old French whore. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It has that type of a... That scent. Dirty... Yeah. Scent. Right, right. And okay. So There's actually a house that has one like that called, uh, it's called, uh, we call it Eldo. Etat Libre, yep. the orange, and it's called the Palace. And uh, yeah, it's, and that one's supposed to be like, I have that. I have a 30 mil of that. Yeah, and it has that kind of flavor too. Let's see what we have here. I know you guys don't know anything about this. Don't worry about that. You don't know about that. We, we high end over here. We don't mess around. Let's see what we got. You mind if I just spray a little sure. about that? Okay. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it does. This is crazy. Yes. Yeah, that is. Yeah, check that out. Yeah, you smell the perfume and everything. Like, yep. man, yeah. Yep. Yeah, they, they captured that. Yes. You can smell the animalic, too. That's interesting. <laughs> oh, they wanted to know how much were the uh, ouds. You have Bacharach up there, too? Yep. Wow, okay, okay. Yeah. You didn't want to know how much were the ouds. Just your average price of the ouds. Uh, I think they're different prices were paying different... Right, because yeah, some of them extraits and some of them are just perfumes. Yeah. 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 Let me tell you honestly what's going on in this conversation here. We've experienced places that you come in and you see all the juices, especially down in the center city, and you're not sure what you're getting. So they're saying, well, how do you know this place is legit? I said, well, first of all, a legit place has this, whereas a non-legit place would have just a whole bunch of designers. So... I don't have to convince them because I told them I purchased from you before. So I have, I'm, I have total confidence. But they're saying, well, how do you know it's like one of the places that you, know, you go to? Well, a legit place has Miller Harris and Valesio, call it. That's what a legit place has. You see what I'm saying? So you can feel comfortable buying from Raj. I bought from Raj before. I'm going to buy maybe two bottles from him today. I'm totally confident. So I want to let you know we have confidence. Raj has confidence. Raj is not that kind of guy. Me and him spoke for like an hour after he closed. So I have all confidence in the world of Raj and his junk. And Julie's. And they're taking inventory. Who takes inventory if they're just selling stuff? Not. So I want y'all to feel comfortable here. That's why I come up here. I'm not going to go to a place I'm not comfortable with. That's why I bring y'all where I go. And you can be totally confident that Raj spot and we call it Perfume Unlimited. Perfume's unlimited. We'll keep it short. You can't beat it. Now, he doesn't have a website yet, but he doesn't need a website. You call him, he ships it, and you got it. I know you trust him, because you can tell a good shop, but some people can't. Novices can't tell a good shop. He has Boise 1920. Who has that? Who has a neat catal? So shop here with confidence, because not like he have everything. He's not like a big, giant chain store. So, uh, oh, and he has House of Siage. That's right. That's right. And he has a woman's he just too, I see. So yeah, shop here with confidence. I mean, I'm telling you, I'm getting two bottles or one bottle a day. I have no problem. I'll back them up with my own confidence that you guys know. So don't be intimidated because y'all see all this. Y'all not used to seeing this. I understand. Y'all not used to seeing Parfums de Marley and, and Atkinson's and, and Odin's. You're not used to seeing this. And we have Clive Christian. You're not used to seeing that. I understand that. You guys don't get around like I get around. You know, you used to go into malls and you don't see half of what they have. You don't see a third of what they have here. And I've been in Neiman's every day. And Neiman's can't even keep up with Raj, what Raj has right here. So I'm telling you, buy with confidence. I'm buying me one or two bottles a day. Be confident. Cool. <laughs> My man said you're a dope clerk. That means you're real. Oh, uh, he was talking about. You look nice. Oh, 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 thank you. Sorry. It's <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay, what are we talking about now? What are we, what are we, oh, the, the uh, oops. Mm, 
that's good. It's getting better and better, too. He also has the eight and bobs, by the way. Eight and bobs. Do you know you're more than welcome to go back there? Like, you can't go back. Oh, yeah, no. He, Raj took me back there before. Yeah, I got to look around. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, though. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Absolutely. I wish you guys were closer, but I ain't mind taking a ride. I'm like, okay, it's an hour, 15 minute ride. I'm on vacation. Let's go. So what we got? Again, I'm giving you special pricing for you. Okay, special pricing for me. Mm -hmm. Right. Wow. Two twenty nine. Now I have this already, so I'm good. Two twenty nine. Now you can't get this price. Sorry, but maybe we can work something out with me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's a good price. That's really a good price. I know, right? That's a good price. They only come in one size, two point four. This is not the big, big one, right? This is the. Uh, this is the. Point. That's 2.4, yeah, because you know they had a big one, too. They had a real uh, tall one. Yeah, it comes in a 200 mm. Right, 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 exactly. Of, mm -hmm. um, yeah, that's a good price. Yeah, I already have it, yeah. If I didn't have it, I would definitely consider it. But y'all know I'm being greedy. I'm trying to get out of here with two bottles, so, you know. But yeah, buck right for 40. So uh, what you get on the Oud? Just the average price of the Oud. Yeah, the extracts, yeah. Or the perfumes, either one. I know X face usually three ninety five. Yeah, I think I only need that big one he likes about uh, about two ninety five. Two ninety five, okay. All right. That's thirty, forty dollars off. All right, so yeah, that's around uh two ninety five, gentlemen. Two ninety five. That's more than that. It's the retails at three eighty. No, I think the extract, yeah, three extracts are three eight, but the regular perfumes I think are three twenty five. Yeah, so but I think it's three twenty five. Yeah, silk mood. Mm -hmm. You know, everybody likes the satin right now. Satin is the hot one right now. Everybody can. Yeah, yeah, extract three seventy five. Yeah, some place three ninety five. Yeah. Yeah, like I say, gentlemen, I'm trying to see here, trying to figure out who am I going to rob to get both of these bottles. Cause I do need a hundred mil of this bow makers. I, I gotta have it. Now this is just this one. It comes with a box and everything. No boxes. No box. No. Right. I have them. I have more in the yeah, like more. wraps already. Right, right. I just didn't know where to put that, so I just put it on the counter. So okay, okay. Yeah, I'll just try to find the bowman in there. Uh, no, I can just buy the bottle. It's, it's mine. I'll take that bottle. Yeah. Cause that's one I sprayed. Then we're gonna see how we can afford this. Uh, well, Harris, that's what we're working on next. Got that. All right, so that's what I'm picking up, you guys. Y'all know I was looking at this at Barney's, and that's a great price, because I know Barney's price. I was just there Sunday. <laughs> so that's a good price. So I got to get that one. Oh, he also has Diptyque, too. He has a couple of Diptyque. He has Sleeping with Ghosts. Can I smell that one more time, Sleeping with Ghosts? Um, Mark Buxton. I remember smelling that long time ago, and I like that. Sleeping with ghosts. The first one. Now come back towards your left. No, no, to your left. Right there. Yeah, sleeping with the ghosts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that one. Mark Buster makes some good juices for good houses. He really does. He's really creative, too. Give me a finger here. Oh, that's crazy. That was crazy. Sleeping with the ghosts. Y'all know anything about that. Don't worry about it. I'll teach y'all about a little bit of something. Y'all used to buy in that mainstream niche. You got to get out of mainstream yeah, niche. Uh, it's boring. Bloom, yeah. Yeah. Sleeping with ghosts. Um, yeah. This is good. This is good. Now... For me, being this is kind of like citrusy, y'all would say, man, I thought you don't like citruses. You don't like citruses. What you got, bro? Well, yeah, they would have to. Yeah, no doubt about it. No doubt about it. They would have to. And that makes sense to me. That makes sense to me, you know. But um, I don't know. That, that, like I said, I'm not into those. So I don't care. I really, I'm into this. 
This is good. This is good. Mm mm mm. Mm, that's good. It's 100 mil. Yep, 100 mil. Seeping with ghosts. Look up seeping with ghosts. Look that up and tell me what you think. That's some good juice. I smelled that like three years ago. I still remember it was good. Through my rock. Well, let me explain to you why the prices are different here than it would be a retail. First of all, some of the scents he's selling are not full presentation. Okay, so you're gonna dis get a dis you're gonna get a discount because they're not full presentation. This is what you get. Now, if you want full presentation, it's gonna cost you regular retail. Perfect example is this. I'll show you again. I showed y'all when I came in. And remember, he's he's buying limited quantities, so he's not buying a whole thing. He's not buying a whole bunch. So here you have all the florists, right? These are all the florists. All right? Now, do you see the tops? All right? So if you want to buy this top, it's 109. But if you want to buy the full presentation, it's going to cost you dang near retail. And he gives you a discount because he's a discounter. That's what he does. Because he got the connect that nobody else could. So just imagine you, when you sell your fragrances. And you don't sell it out the box. You might be selling it just to be selling it. You're not going to, you can't charge the full price. You can't because you don't have a full presentation. You don't have everything. So you definitely have to look at that as being an aspect of it. But then again, like I said, you had Robert Piquet too about a well. I have Visa. Mm -mm -mm. I really, really like this. I'm starting to like this almost more than Bowmakers. This is good. Right, exactly, exactly, just what I'm saying. So, <clears throat> as you can see, okay, but because, like I said, he's not a retailer, he don't have to sell the retailer price. Remember, retailers mark up the price as well. So even though, even though Francis Kirk John say, okay, sell my ooh for 375, they don't have to sell for three seventy five. He's telling them to sell for three seventy five. They're not paying three seventy five. They're not. They're not paying Francis Kirk John three seventy five for their juice, and you know that. That's why there's so much walk, walking around like testers and all that stuff. I got a Clive Christian tester for one hundred and twenty five dollars. One hundred twenty five dollars for a Clive Christian tester. You know where it came from? It came from an employee in a store. So you know if they sell the testers for one twenty five, you know. The, the, the price is the retail price. It's like when you buy a car. You know what I mean? They can either discount the car or you can buy, you can pay the retail. You see? So, so what you got to do is think about that. Can you? Which one though? There's a couple. Is it Maroc? This one right here? Is it Maroc? Check that one out. Maroc. No, no, no. This one right here. They're different prices. This one right here. Find that one right there for me. A Robbie was okay. Because I have all of them right here. I had a six that I smelled. Out of those six, I like my rock.
Wow. See, that's not bad. So the price he giving me is just about that price. So that's a good price. Let me tell you something. I would rather purchase from here in a fragrance net any day. First of all, it's a personal, it's a personal thing. I don't know anybody at fragrance net. So I'm not interested in fragrance net or fragrance X. Y'all know I don't buy from them wholesalers. I just don't. I'm not buying from wholesalers. I don't trust where they had their juices. I just don't. I would buy from Rise or I would buy from Near any day before I would buy that. So I don't know. I don't know. 37% discount don't mean that the top notes are not off the scent. Exactly. You buy something, you, you look at the notes, you're like, okay, this is supposed to have plum in it. But then when you get it, it doesn't have plum in it because the top note done, done blew off. Because they probably had it sitting in heat. They probably had it sitting around somewhere. So I don't trust Fragrance Net. I don't, I don't try, I don't, I never bought anything from no Tino, Fragrance Net, Fragrance X, from anybody like that. Now, I might have bought some juice from somebody personally who may have bought it from there, but I've never, never bought anything from them sites. I just, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I'd rather be here with somebody that I know. And if I had a problem, I can call them up and say, look, Raj, when I got home, this doesn't smell like the one I have, or something like that. Then I'm sure he would understand. He would say, well, look, Raj, it's like this. You can't call a fragrance net and say that. And that's why it's best that you go to a place where you can sniff what you want to buy anyway. So if somebody tell you, if I tell you that, okay, bow makers is hot, and you say, well, I got to trust you, Raj. Okay, so where are you going to buy it from? You're going to buy it from Barney's and pay 200 or 180 whatever, or you're going to buy it from Fragrance X and you get $30 off. But then when you get it, it doesn't smell like that because you didn't get a chance to smell it. You see what I'm saying? I'm buying my bottle that I smell. I'm not getting the full presentation on this. I'm just getting the bottle. That's why he gave me a great price on it. So, and I, I, I'm wearing mine right now. And I know how it smells because I just smelled it at Barney's. So, I don't know. Y'all buy your discounters where y'all want to buy your discounters. I'm getting mine from up here. That's... Yeah, you can return your fragrance, but you write better to get out of shop. That's right. And here's the thing about it. How many people return the fragrance? You're probably buying that return fragrance. That's why it's so cheap. Have you ever thought about that? Have you ever thought you buying fragrances that were returned? Somebody might keep it for 30 days and return it back to Macy's or return it back to Bloomingdale's and then they bought those returns. You ever think about that? Because Macy's didn't want to keep returns, so why would they keep returns? Get returns to a discounter. And like I said, the scent that I'm looking at today, which I'm so heck glad he had it, because I'm like, man, I want bow makers so bad that he has. Who's selling bow makers besides Barney's? Why would he, as a discounter, ask for bow makers? Why? Well, here's the debaser right here. So, anyway, you guys make up your mind. I'll give you his number and everything. If you feel comfy like I do, then call them up and they ship. And they got plenty of juice. They got juice you're not going to find everywhere. They got juice you only can find in Barney's. Like I said, Atkinson's is in Barney's, Odin's is in Barney's. They got juice you find in Barney's. Frappen, that's Barney's. So they got Barney's juice up in here. 1920 is Barney's. I'm trying to tell y'all. Look here, I'm not babysitting you. Y'all figure it out for yourself. I'll be smelling good, and you'll still be buying from Fragrance X. Fragrance net, and I'll be smelling good. Holler at your boy. All right, I'm ready to go because I'm ready to do business. I'm gonna holler at y'all later. What time is it? Yeah, they're about to close in a minute, so I want to hold them over. You have Diviasa right here, by the way. I'm sorry. You have it right here. Remember you said it was over there? Oh. The Debasa. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have it right here, yeah, yeah. But that's the box that will come in. Is that the same box that will come in? Uh, the same type of box? If, if I had ordered them back. Right, right, right. Okay, okay. I got you, got you. Okay. I figured, hey. Why? I don't need the box. My collection is crazy right now. They don't have boxes in them. All, okay. all our niche customers mm -hmm. has yet to give one away as a gift. <laughs> right. It's not going to have it. Right.
Now, just so happens that usually the MFK, I, I can't get them mm -hmm. like this, you know, so right. I take whatever right, we can I, get. I, I can get. Mm -hmm. So, for, the, for my, 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 um, my um, niche mm -hmm. customers, okay, is that as of yet, they have not given this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They are more than happy when I can get this because they know it. I say. Right, right. That only gets passed on to them. Mm -hmm. yeah. Can't beat it. Yeah. The problem is can't always do it because Right, I understand. The, the availability's not there. Right, right. You gotta get it when you can. Like you said, this thing. Well I totally understand. I, I know how it goes. Yeah. I'm fine. How much is that ghost? Uh, I like both of these, but I got a budget, so I gotta be careful. So this is that's gonna be one something. What's the ghost? I have 116 on the back. Not into it. I'm not going to do it. Ninety-six for that. Okay, you knock off twenty. And the lowest you can do on the Maroc was, what was that again? One hundred six. Okay. Okay. Hey, me, me, and you both. All right, y'all. I'm being out. I'll talk to y'all later. Take a call tonight. Talk to you.